up you guys welcome back to another vlog um today i'm not sure if i'm gonna make this a day in the life vlog uh days in the life or a week in my life i'm not sure but we're just gonna go with the vibes you guys i'm not sure what we're gonna be doing but i'm gonna take you guys along with me today i have a couple errands to run um some grocery shopping stuff like that that i need to get done so i'm just gonna take you guys along with me i guess and we'll just see how it goes shopping um unfortunately for some reason i ended up taking all day like literally six hours to go grocery shopping so i'm gonna go ahead and show you guys everything i got i got quite a bit um don't don't ask me how i spent that long i don't know but i'm gonna go ahead and show y'all what all i got okay guys this is quite a bit so i'm gonna start on this side and then move that way and show you guys what all i have all right so I bought some lemon, some yams, some regular potatoes. Um, these are mini cucumbers, some mini sweet peppers, kale, spinach, um, not me being ashy, some oranges. Um, these are some bananas. I bought one plantain, uh, an avocado. Uh, these are um, zucchini, some tomatoes some mixed vegetables, um, two different fruit blends. Um, I got some French green beans. I've never cooked these before, so I'm excited to try them out, figure out if I know what I'm doing or if I can really cook for real. <laughs> um, I got me some chai because I love chai. Um, I got some vinegar, some cold brew, um, and then I got some French dressing, some mustard. I got some yogurt. Um, what is this? Some cottage cheese. What's this? Um, I got some cinnamon. I got two packs of eggs. Um, okay, let's see. And then on this side, I have like a couple of snacks because I usually don't buy snacks at the store, but I've started to realize that like whenever I want to eat and I just want something quick, I don't ever have anything I can just grab because I'm always having and I always have to like make myself a meal but I got a couple snacks that I absolutely love um and have been loving for years so um I got some tortilla chips um I absolutely 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 love 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 tortilla chips and salsa so I got like two things of salsa I got some skinny pop popcorn some rice cakes these three these three snacks alone i could live off of love it um i got me some granola some applesauce um some rice and then over here are just like a few little quick things i can make if i'm you know if i need to go to work and i'm running behind or something like that this i've never had it before um it's just a tuna bowl with the rice i saw it at walmart and i was like you know let me try it um because yeah and then this is like i don't know but you see it and it looks good so i wanted to try it um i got some cream cheese um some lemon pepper pink salmon i've never had this before i wanted to try it and this um and then over here i just kind of got some stuff for the whole house um stuff that i don't really eat well this is for me i got some pita bread and some bagels for me and then this stuff is kind of just for the rest of the house stuff that I don't usually eat or stuff that, you know, I thought the house might need. And, you know, I just had the money to spend. So, you know, I got it. Yeah. So that's pretty much everything that I have. So much stuff. Oh, and I bought some water. I forgot. 
so yeah you guys i bought a lot of stuff today um i'm just gonna go ahead and put these up and then i'm not sure what i'm gonna do next because i did not expect this to take all day but even still i didn't have any plans so yeah we're just gonna i'm gonna put these up and then i'll figure out what i'm gonna do after that <laughs> talk about like that scripture that i highlighted um i try to like put it back on the screen or like uh, at least you know put up what the scripture was so that you guys know what i'm talking about but today i went to church um to this new church i've never been there before and i i've read that scripture before but today it just kind of like hit different like i read it different and i know like each time you read a scripture you can get a different perspective so you know it makes sense but it just did something different today so like when i read that scripture this morning instead of me you know reading it the way i normally would um or understanding it in the way i normally would i understood it to me despite all the things that you go through all the things that i endure in my life like i shouldn't despise the things that i'm going through like it's part of the journey so like instead of being discouraged by the journey being discouraged because of the journey like focus on and delight and delight in the fact that i'm going through it because i'm growing keeping my eyes on the promise but at the same time focusing on who i am right now and not just focusing on what i'm going through and what i can do to like make my situation better like just living in the right now and focusing on how i can be better as an individual in the midst of trials um and I don't know, something about that just touched different because I feel like that's the season that I've been in. I don't know, but I just wanted to highlight that for a quick second. Um, yeah, but now that I've said that, I do want to let you guys know. Um, I don't want to make this whole video about like what happened to me, where I've been, because like, I know I took a couple months off. Um, I haven't really like been posting it much since October. Um, and yes, there are reasons for that, things that happened and things that I went through. But honestly, um, I've come to the conclusion, you guys, that the reality is that's life. Like, 
I'm always going to be going through something. Something's always going to be happening. Though I may not post about it or stuff is going to be going on behind the scenes. Like, I have to live with that. I have to accept that. And I have to push forward and keep moving. And allow myself, you know, a moment to pivot. Like, and accept change, if that makes sense. Accept that, you know, I can't let my discipline go. I can't let my emotions di dictate my discipline. Things are always going to be happening. There are always going to be things that... We want to be better, things that we wish we could make better, um, things that we wish we could change. But if you take your eyes off that, like I was just talking about, which literally just all doing what it needs to do. But like um, if you just take your eyes off that and focus on what you can do in the moment, how you can continue being better or how you can just strive for better today, like literally just today. Like I know there's a scripture that says, you know, don't worry about tomorrow because tomorrow has you know it's own problems but literally like literally living like that waking up and thinking like how can i be great today like um with all that being said i want to show you guys um something i picked up at walmart so i picked up the native almond shea butter almond and shea butter conditioner now i've used this brand before and i like it because it's clean so i started using this brand my first year um in college i like i liked um the soap and stuff because like it's a clean brand and you can literally read the instructions and see what's in it i mean not the instructions the ingredients and see what's in it um but i've never tried like the shampoo or conditioner so i got some of this because i need to do my hair like i don't know if y'all can tell but like you see it just needs to be done so i need to do that um and I got some other stuff right here. And I have another brand that I'm trying out today because I have to do my hair later on. So I actually saw this brand. Um, okay, it's called BTL. Um, and the BTL stands for braids, twists, and locks. I saw this brand a couple months ago when I was looking to do my hair. I was looking for like something to um like like kind of like a braiding gel this and actually the beauty supply store and then i went home and like looked up some stuff on tiktok and looked up some stuff online and stuff so like just basically do some research see how well it worked if it was a good product etc like the ingredients all that good stuff um and i didn't try it because i found something else but i don't have all of my things right now so um yeah i went and got some more because i have to do my hair today and so i want to try this brand i got um I got this purple kind. I don't really know. Um, I don't know. But it says it has level four performance. And then I also got the foamy lotion too to go with it. Um, so I guess I'll be trying out these two products today. See if they work. Hopefully they will. Okay, you guys, before I end off the video, I just wanted to come on here and show you guys, first of all, this makeup because I like it. This is my first time doing this kind of look, but I like it. And I want to show you guys what I finally did with my hair. I'm not sure how I feel about it. I kind of like it, but the rubber bands are like breaking already. So there's that. But I wanted to show you guys this bottle I bought. Um, I've saw it on TikTok before, but I have been looking for a glass water bottle anyway. So I got it and I am in love. I just got it last night. Um, and then I just have some fruit in there, but y'all I am in love and it comes with this sleeve and it comes also with like a tool to wash the inside of the bottle. So yeah, I am in love. But that's all I have for you guys today. Thank you for watching. Please tune in to my next video and I'll see you guys next time.